I have a friend who recently got a Sony Cybershot camera and as a storage medium it uses Memory Stick Pro Duo. So Memory Stick Pro Duo, how you would normally unload your data or transfer it to a computer would be via uh, an adapter which looks like this and your memory stick duo would go in this end here this is the back end and this here would you'd plug this into the side of your computer there'd be a slot that would accommodate this shape right here and that's how you transfer data to and from your computer from your memory stick pro duo memory stick pro duo was the storage medium used on Sony Cybershot cameras as well as the Sony PSP. A lot of newer computers don't have this slot on the side of the computer. These slots have been removed because this is now obsolete. This was made obsolete about five years ago. It had a good 10, 12, maybe 15 year run as a storage medium, but it's obsolete now. So this video is going to show how you can transfer data from your memory stick duo to your, to your computer using just the standard USB port. So this is the slot here. This is the port that's required for that adapter that I just showed you. This used to be on the side of a, of a laptop and a lot of modern laptops don't have this particular input input slot anymore so one thing you can do is you can get a different kind of adapter which looks like this this one's branded by sony your memory stick duo would go in here and as you can see it has a standard USB USB input here on this end. So your memory stick duo would go in here. So this would be your this would be your adapter. And it has a USB up here. There it is with the cap cat protector. And there's another shot. Another option would be a, an all-in-one like this. Here you have a standard USB right here. This represents your memory stick duo. And on this side, this this unit right here accommodates micro SD as well. And you can see USB mini on this back end here. So this one's like more like a Swiss Army knife. And it's, it's, this one's just an all-in-one type thing. This is an off-brand. It's unbranded. I don't know how reliable this is. I don't know what the lifespan of one of these is. Something like this is probably only about 15, 20 bucks. This one here I saw on BestBuy.ca. This was 19.99 for this unit. And here's an old cyber shot. So you'd have your memory stick duo is how you'd store all your pictures and your videos. And eventually you're gonna have to unload that to a PC. So if you don't have a PC with a an adequate slot for an adapter like this, your option is to get something like that like that here. Another thing you can do is if if you do have a device that's using Memory Stick Pro Duo and you want to use micro SD, you can get this adapter here or an adapter like this. This is basically the same shell as a Memory Stick Duo. A Memory Stick Pro Duo, I should say. Memory Stick Duo was twice as long. That was discontinued a long time ago. So this is actually Memory Stick Pro Duo that we're talking about. It's much shorter. 
memory card and as you can see micro SD slides right into this clicks in and then your micro SD is now in a shell which is the same as a, a memory stick pro duo so those are your options if you don't have a particular the slot that's required for an adapter like this you can you can get something like this or that personally I like branded stuff even with Memory Stick Duo, I only use Sony branded ones. I don't use Lexar and I don't use uh, SanDisk because those can sometimes have data corruption. And if you're on vacation or whatever and you're using your Sony digital camera, you don't want that stuff getting corrupted. You don't want your files corrupted using some off brand memory stick duo so me personally i don't use anything other than sony branded memory stick pro duo there, there's a there's a psp memory stick duo on the psp goes in up here somewhere lid opens up pops out pop the memory stick duo in it's behind here somewhere that's got all your save data your files, your video files, your maybe your ISO or MP4 or maybe eBoot. So there you have it. That's an option if you don't have those those slots on the side of your computer and you need to transfer data from a mem memory stick duo to your computer. And you can't use one of these because you don't have the slot, just use something like that. 